Hello YouTube, in this video I'll be showing you how to back up your files and settings. This is a very easy process and you can do it being a beginner, uh, intermediate or an advanced user. Now, the first step is to get a USB or a, an external hard drive or something like that so you can back up, you can put all your stuff, all your documents or your settings onto the USB or whatever you're using. So first, if you're using the USB, plug it into one of the many USB ports you'll find on your computer. And remember, this is an XP tutorial, so it won't be the same on Windows 7 or Vista or any of those. It might be similar, but it won't be the same. So, first we need to go to Start. So we click on the Start button. Then we need to click Run, which should be down on the right hand corner. Click on that. Let the run box, which should look like this, run up. Then type in NT Backup. So that's NT Backup. No spaces. Hit Enter or click OK. And let this uh, program load. After it's loaded, you will see a little setup looking like box saying welcome to the backup or restore wizard now now we need to click next and then this should come up and then you can because you want to back up your files and settings you click up backup and when you want to when when you if you lose all your computer settings you will click restore in this now you click next And then it's asking, what do you want to back up? Uh, the current setting is my documents and settings. Or uh, you can go, let me choose what to back up. And go all the information on this computer. You can do everyone's if you've got multiple users. I'm going to click all the information on this computer. Click next. And now you choose your... Uh, the like external hard drive or USB. My USB is called Kingston Your Drive, and that's in the E, -E port. Uh, yeah. Type a name for this backup. Backup. I think I'll stick with this. Um. And now we can click next. Here we go, and it's just telling you've created these backup settings and you can close this wizard and start the backup by clicking finish or hit the enter key because it's selected there we go and this should come up you see this is the backup process on XP so it should look something like this and it will back up remember this may take quite a while and on depending on how much uh, stuff you have on your computer how much you have selected to back up so don't switch your computer off while doing this keep it on so here we go now I think that concludes this video now you'll be able to back up all your stuff on your computer and then it will be safely stored in the USB which you should try not to lose otherwise you will not be able to restore your computer's settings and documents when or if it, everything gets deleted say if you have a major virus and your computer gets infected and you can't do anything about it for some reason and you have to get a new computer then you'll want all your settings and all that so thank you and please comment rate and subscribe please hit the like button and see you in my next video. Goodbye.